I'm Master Sahil Kumar Das and once again in my YouTube channel with my mathematics video. Here, yes, class 8 mathematics chapter 1, rational numbers, CBSC and CRT course. So let us discuss about rational numbers without wasting our time. As for you know that time is very precious in our life. So definition. What exactly is that? Means uh, rational numbers as per our topic is being mentioned. So rational number. You know, when we all know that there are many types of you know numbers such as natural numbers, whole numbers, integers, and many more. But one kind of rational numbers that means another type of numbers which is called as rational number. So to define it, what will be the definition as per respective to rational number? So rational numbers are just one type of numbers which are represented in P by Q form where H, P and Q are integers and Q is not equal to 0. All you understand? All you need to understand is three points. Nothing. But to define the rational number, just we need to remember and print in our mind three points. The first point will be that all which rational numbers are represented in P by Q form. Representation in P by Q form. Understood? What will be the second point? Second point is that P and Q are integers. That means either positive, either negative, or G. That means all we know that integers numbers are what? All natural numbers including all negative numbers are called as integers. So P and Q should must be integers for representation in P by Q form whereas Q is not equal to 0 guys. This is you know the main and the first point which you need to remember. Because Q should not be equal to 0. Otherwise, see, P by Q form. Okay, 5 and 0. As per we mentioned, that P by Q form should be means, uh, very necessary for rational numbers formation. So, 5 by 0 should be rational number. But no. Because Q should not be equal to 0. That means the representation of denominator in rational numbers. H per so, wherever it is being... 5 or 6, 3 do not matter, but should not be 0. Understood guys? So for definition, what will you have to do? Representation in P by Q form, P and Q should must be integers, Q should not be equal to 0. And this is the definition of rational numbers. Then we will move on to the next topic. And what will be the next topic guys? That topic is types of rational numbers. What are the different categorization of rational numbers? First of all, we will understand about numbers. Numbers are of generally two types. Real and non-real. This is also an important thing. Before understanding the introduction of rational number. So real once again divided into two parts. Rational and irrational. First of all we will define real numbers. What are real numbers? Real numbers are numbers which have a fixed value. That means it has the fixed value such as 5. We all know that 5 plus 5 equal 10. And here the value of 5 is also important. For the formation whenever added to 5 each will be 10. Let us know about non-real numbers. So non-real numbers are actually the numbers which have an imaginary value. That means which are not real. Such as you know 5 plus 4 equal 10. This is an imaginary value. This is 5 plus 4 equal 9. Even one class, you know, children also know. But if I will say that, no, 5 plus 3 equal not 8. It is 10. That means it's an imaginary thing. Never 
therefore it will be possible so therefore it will be non real numbers but it exists so we will come to the categorization of real numbers now what are rational numbers as per we discussed rational numbers are numbers which are represented in p by q form and whereas p and q are integers but q is not equal to 0 but irrational numbers now what are irrational numbers simply we can understand from their formation of word that irrational that means the numbers which are not rational so which numbers are not rational but we understood that the you know integers are also rational numbers natural numbers are also in, you know integers so as per integers are rational numbers so natural numbers will also be you know the type of rational numbers whole numbers are as well as rational numbers so which kind of numbers are not rational number that we will say they are in the categorization of irrational they are five square root two this type of things you know we can find out the value of five square that it is twenty five but whenever we are writing twenty five here that will be rational number but the number five square will be an irrational number understood now. Let us know about another thing. Understood? And that's about the values of rational numbers in number line. Representation in number line. First of all, what is number line? That is also important. Right? But before that, guys, we will look out about rational numbers categorization. Because rational numbers are once again categorized into two types the first and foremost is positive and the second is negative what is positive positive rational numbers means the numbers which have either even sign or same signs or we can say that plus signs or no signs that will be positive that means plus sign plus seven Minus 8, minus 9. Next to same signs, that means minus, minus, and here bracket. These all things will be called as positive. And even if, if we will write 5, then it is also a positive rational number. Negative rational numbers are numbers which are not positive. That means which are either different signs or minus signs. That means minus 7, minus 8, minus 11 or we can say plus minus in the bracket 11 and all the things. Thank you and have a nice day guys. In the next part we will read about representation of you know rational numbers in numbers line and all the things else. So thank you and very much. If you like this video then please subscribe the channel and like and comment. So thank you all. And I am ending my video. Bye-bye.